5 o'clock tonight, knowing your neighborhood's flood risk. FEMA updated the flood maps for the city of Naples, and now they want people to know their specific okay. hurricane okay. risk and what to do if you need to evacuate. To Today, the city hosted two open houses to answer people's questions and concerns. Link News reporter Michelle Alvarez live at Baker Park for us now. Michelle, what was the biggest concern brought up today? Chris, people told me it's important to know your area's flood risk in order to protect your property. The city of Naples is hosting open houses today after the recent adoption of new FEMA flood maps as we get ready for another hurricane season. We all remember this, the damage left behind by Hurricane Ian. If you want to make sure that you're safe from any flood risk, know what your risks are and, and protect yourself from that. This open house is providing people with more information about the updated flood maps and to answer any questions or concerns they may have. Well, the maps uh, were updated uh, in 2019. They were called the preliminary maps then, and they went into effect on February 8th of 2024. Steve Beckman with the city of Naples said FEMA is here to help answer questions about the zones and potential flooding. We've got some information here. I've got a little pamphlet here on flood safety. We've got other um, uh, handouts here to uh, go over flood risks and, and things you can do to protect yourself. I met people on their way out who found the open house helpful. The last hurricane, the water came up to the door, but it did not come in. Pat McCabe lives in Collier County, but still made her way over here to learn more. I'm concerned that the next hurricane will come in, and consequently I want to get as much information as I can to protect the house in the future. Robert Burns has lived in Naples for 11 years. We were okay. We uh, lost uh, all the cars, but uh, we did not have water in our uh, first floor because our original building plans, which were uh, m constructed in 1978, raised the building 10 feet above mean sea level, and that was enough to protect our first floor. They both agree it's important to know your area's risk of flooding. We have to get the word out that uh, you, you need flood insurance uh, to be able to cover yourself in an event of a, of a flood so that, or a hurricane surge. Anyone is welcome to attend the open house, and the evening session runs till 7 p.m. tonight. For more information, just visit winknews.com. I'm live at Baker Park, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News.